formal bow is complete. First onto the tatami will be Matteo Busato. He's such a strong athlete. You know, watching him through his preliminary rounds, he came out and can execute and put power down without losing uh, his traction, if you will. And We'll see if we can keep it going here today. Chance to make a comparison here because he's performing the Kata Goji Shihodai, which was the same that was performed by Karim Walid Ghali of Egypt just a few moments ago. Great poise so far. Mm -hmm. Really showing the difference between these fast and slow movements is going to be crucial here. That's an example of what you're just talking about, Cameron. That was really, really good. Yeah. See his body just brilliant, stops. Brilliant yeah. Yeah. transitions. <laughs> yeah, having someone like him with this skill level makes this cut to look so good. Again, stopping and turning on a dime. Very impressive. Yeah. It's one of those things where we don't have to say too much because the kata no. speaks for itself, you know? Totally <laughs> does. Totally does. the kind of cut that he's going to have to bring in order to bring down Japan. This is, this is a solid performance by him. Well, we have Nishiyama to come out next. He wouldn't have been too interested in the performance of Basato be focusing on his own performance. But I have to say, he's going to have to pull out a really good kata to beat Basato because that was very, very good. That was solid through and through. Change in, change in speed, change in direction, everything was on point, no slips at all. Great control throughout the whole kata. It's cool because both katas are on the longer side of them all. And being able to maintain top form throughout the whole duration is such, such a hard thing to do. Nishiyama Kakero choice of kata suprempe different style
while the contests are different styles, I think there's a comparable note in them having slow and fast sequences at the beginning and how they step through everything. And I think that's one of the best parts about cuts is despite the fact that there's different styles and you know the athletes are performing different movements, there's a lot of direct comparables. Of course, with the, the blocks and strikes and kicks of karate, it's evident in all styles. Yama's on fire too. He's on point. Speed of the transition is really good, and the stance is the shape of the feet position. Looking for that on both sides during the embassy of the shape of the kata. I mean, and that's exactly what makes him so good, is him knowing exactly where every single body part needs to be in order to make the move most efficient, as strong as possible, and to maintain the control throughout everything that he's doing. See the appreciation from the audience there clapping that. I think that says something for itself, right? There's there's usually it cut yep. yeah. Cuts as segments that people clap at, whether it's a jump or yep. anything, yep. you know, spectacular. But that's not one of them and they did, you know. Feel the whole body and the tension that he's holding. Mm -hmm. Each movement's great. And that's the hara, the tension in the stomach, the lower abdomen. Wow! Yeah. There you have it. That was brilliant. Ah! He's feeling good. Yeah, you can see the intensity in his eyes. And he's feeling good after that performance. He, know, he knows he's done well, doesn't oh, he? Yeah. Has he done well enough? But this is what this competition's all about. Both athletes hit pinpoint katas. They brought their best. They left it on the floor. Now it's just going to come to that final decision of what the judges saw exactly. Your opinion on this one, because he's not your friend so sure, much. Sure, right, yeah, no, I don't have so much of a stake in this <laughs> one, right? Um, I'm thinking... I'm thinking blue, Japan is going to pull away, but it's going to be a narrow victory. Well done, Cameron. 44.4 against 42.9. Two solid athletes, though, through and through. There's something to be said for the Italian athlete's performance was spot on. He brought it all out there. You see him walking away. Obviously disappointed, but there's appreciation for the performance. And the same thing. Now the Japanese athlete smiles a little bigger with the medal too, and he deserves it. Well